Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. Good morning out there. Good evening, depending on where you are in our world. Shiba Inu is taking over our world in a lot of ways, and we've got three green candlesticks in a row here after some consolidation. Of course, we were talking about this tight range, this consolidation phase, and saying, hey, the longer this lasts, the better, because then we usually get an outburst and an outbreak, and we are seeing that over the past three days. This is October 23rd, 24th, and 25th. We are heading up higher, and right now we are up 5%. All the technicals indicating a strong buy right now. The Shiba Inu community is continuing to enjoy these gains. Saitama is crushing it right now, too. So many great things happening. If you want to know more about what we're buying, what we're selling, what we're talking about, Patreon link is down below in the description. Come on over and check us out. That link is down there in the description, as well as a bunch of different referral links, too, if you want to open up an account over at, uh, let's say, Robinhood, Weeble, Coinbase, Crypto.com. Got you covered with all four down below in the description. So, of course, the uh, days range here, we're trading in a pretty tight range. The 3.5 level is our low spot. The 4.1 level is the high spot. But in this video, I want to talk about the whales. So Shiba Inu whales are responsible for a 300% price jump. And let's jump into some of the data. Uh, so firm sentiment suggests Shiba Inu whales are behind every one of the price jumps and pumps since SHIB first took off this month. Of course, if you're just new to the Shiba Inu ecosystem, we've been going through some rough months, okay? In June, July, and August, and September, things were not pretty. Uh, we were down there in the 059, 06 range. Okay, obviously we have since five, six, seven X from there, but uh, there were three to four months there where things were not great. But uh, we talked about it every day. We held steady, we were buying dips and uh, here we go, right? However, everything changed when we turned into quarter number four. When we turned the page into October, Shiba Inu and the entire crypto market started turning green. And some uh, data here indicates that every time SHIB has seen a pop, it has been big whales coming in to join the party. So by overlaying the price with transaction counts greater than 100,000, they noted spiking transaction counts over 100,000 were followed by increases in the price of SHIB. But keep an eye on SHIB's whale transactions exceeding 100K. When these transactions come in bunches, price rises generally follow because what happens is obviously the whales drive up the price with these big purchases, but then because there are spikes in the charts, you get a bunch of retail investors who want to ride that wave up, right? So it's kind of a, a FOMO effect, if you will. Now, while token holders stand to benefit from this support, it begs the question whether SHIB is highly manipulated and what happens if the whales decide to move on. Is Shiba Inu winning over the skeptics? Well, SHIB has had tremendous growth since the start of this month, but the project still is facing a great deal of skepticism. However, I just put out a video earlier this morning saying, you know, how Guy from uh, Coin Bureau and the guys from Altcoin Daily, they are coming around to Shiba Inu. And this is going to help because these are big time influencers and crypto enthusiasts and experts now talking about SHIB in a different light. Now, there's also the matter of its one quadrillion token supply, which investor Michael Berry said makes it a pointless investment choice. Of course, we know that Michael Berry is huge Bitcoin maximalist. So take that with a grain of salt. All respect to him. Very, very smart and an intelligent guy. Nonetheless, proponents say Shiba Inu is much more than a meme coin. I agree. They point to its expanding ecosystem. This is what people don't necessarily understand. Shibarium, right? Which already includes a DEX. They don't understand that. NFT support. They might not know about that. Governance protocols and staking. They probably don't know much about Shiba Swap, right? About the Shibarium future. Now, the CEO of Block Journal Magazine remains doubtful of Shiba Inu's continued success. He said the dog-themed trend is easily off, uh, is eased off lately in favor of DeFi and NFTs, but I mean, not really when you look at the charts. Adding that the price effect of hype eventually dies down. We'll see. The dog coin hype has slowed down significantly over the last few months. There are many other points of focus in the industry lately with far more substance such as DeFi and NFTs. Listen, I like DeFi and NFTs as well, and that's why I'm diversified. That's why I always stress having a diversified portfolio, uh, and I love DeFi. I'm in a lot of DeFi plays. I'm in a lot of NFT plays, but I'm also in SHIB, 
and Saitama and Dogecoin. So diversify your portfolio. Now, they talk about Robinhood here too and their rival listing SHIB. Of course, that's public.com. Uh, a lot of coverage here on public.com. I don't know how much volume is going to come out of there, but I mean, the real story right now before a Robinhood listing is Coinbase. Coinbase is driving retail adoption of Shiba Inu. There is no question about it. The, the numbers are eye popping and skyrocketing by the day. I created a video about this pretty recently. Check out that on the channel. There's just a logo of Coinbase and SHIB back to back. I believe I put it out on Saturday, a couple of days ago. Go check that out because the Shiba Inu growth on Coinbase is massive. And Coinbase loves it, by the way. They are generating promotional tweets, promotional content, advertisements on their platforms, promoting Shiba Inu on their own platform. It has skyrocketed past Ethereum and major cryptocurrencies in volume recently. So keep an eye on that. Now, although the meme coin debate continues to rage on, there's another factor to consider when it comes to SHIB, and that's the high concentration of whale accounts controlling the tokens. But many projects have whales, and uh, I think these whales are similar to SHIB retail investors. They want to hold for the long term. They're not in this just for a day or two. They understand the long-term impact this can have on the entire crypto space. That's what I believe. I want to know what you believe down below in the comment section. Make sure you hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and Patreon link, of course, is down there in the description if you want to come join us. Thanks so much for stopping by. Appreciate it. As always, very grateful for you. Like that smash button. See you in the next one.